Good morning and welcome to Mason County Career Center. I'm Mrs. Moore. My instructors would love to tell you what's going on in our building, so come on in we'll see what we can find out. Hi, I'm Amy Miller, one of the Ag teachers here at the Mason County Career Center. I'm one of the FFA advisors and I teach introductory agriculture to 7th and 8th graders. I also teach AgroScience 1 and AgroScience 2 to our freshmen and sophomores. And we'll be doing animal production and horticulture as well. Welcome to Mason County Career Center. Welcome to Mason County Career Center. Come on in. This is Therapeutic Services Program. Um, we offer uh, several programs here, including phlebotomy, uh, the CNA program, of course. Um, these are some of the girls um, who will be working to get their CNA, their phlebotomy, their EKG. It's a two-year program. Therapeutic Services offers fundamentals of healthcare, advanced principles, and 55 clinical hours. When you're done, you'll be able to run uh, and get a job in the workforce or go to college. Hello, my name is Mr. Walmsley and welcome to uh, Mason County Career Center's Graphic Design. Uh, you can come in and have a look around. We do uh, all kinds of uh, artwork, sketching, logo design, t-shirt design, anything that will communicate a message. Uh, that's what we do here in the graphic design department. And uh, we welcome any, anyone who's creative, likes to sketch and draw, use computer technology to uh, give us a visit and uh, maybe sign up for the class. My name is Steve Richardson and this is Project Leap Away Engineering. In this program, my students learn how to do lots of different projects when it comes to different types of engineering. Right now they are working on architectural engineering where they learn to create house plans and put them on sites and they learn all about building construction. My students also learn about structural engineering, mechanical engineering, civil engineering, Here at the engineering program, we do a lot of uh, group-based stuff. I mean, not as much this year where we have COVID and we can't get around each other, but it really teaches you to like work with somebody and cooperate with somebody. And it teaches you that, you know, it's good to work with other people because somebody might have a strength that you're not good at. And it really kind of helps bring everyone together in the classroom. And uh, we have our, like, it's company-based. So everybody has a job. Everybody learns that, you know, you have a responsibility. You have to, you know, if somebody's not doing their job, the project manager, you know, you got to get on them and that will teach you to, you know, hold each other accountable in the real world when stuff actually goes down and it's fun. We learn a lot of stuff and if you plan on doing anything with any type of engineering degree, you know, this is a great class to take because it gets you prepared for that first freshman year of college when we kind of re-go over all of this and uh, you'll be ahead of the game. It's a good program and I suggest it for anyone. My name is Lawrence Gray and I'm the electrical instructor at the Mason County Career Center. We have a wonderful pro program, wonderful electrical program, and but today we're here at the Tewindawee uh, Museum, Museum House. We're rewiring this whole building from the basement to the attic. We have three, four floors to take care of. And uh, we enjoy the work, they enjoy the work. I have some fine boys here finishing up the top floor now, but we have a lot more yet to do. 
But it's a wonderful program, and I'm sure you'll enjoy it if you get involved in it. It's uh, just something that's a little extraordinary. Hopefully, eventually, it would lead to you getting your electrical license. And uh, a good job, good paying job. There's always work to do in the electrical field. It's always there. So we appreciate you coming and hope that you come and join our class. Hello, my name is Bill Mallet, and I've been a machinist for over 52 years and have gone with, uh, not gone a day without a good paid job. I want to tell you, I went to work right out of high school and have been in industry for 15 years and have spent 37 years at Mason County Career Center. In my class, we will begin with the basics and work through many skill sets and with operations of computer numerical control. Uh, currently, there is an extremely high demand for machinists and CNC operators with a pay rate of $15 to $50 per hour. To succeed, a machinist is helpful to have good attendance and great work, work ethic and hands on uh, for hands-on work. Characteristics sound familiar, you may have to be the next step on a promising career. The main reason I like it is because he makes us actually work. Like we don't come in here and slack around. But it is it is fun. Like we come in here it's not super hard, but it's it's tough to learn how to do all the stuff, learn how to work all the machines. But um it's it's fun to work with your buddies in here. But it's also good to learn how to do these things and learn how to work together and all this stuff. Yeah. Come on in. Hello, I'm Sam Nybert. I'm the vocational agriculture teacher here at the Mason County Career Center, and I'd like to introduce a, a couple of students here to talk about the program. The agriculture program provides uh, leadership and personal growth. This is Hannah Wood. SAEs. Okay. All right, so our SAEs are through our FFA, and basically, you can pick any topic you want, be it animals, mechanics, or plants, and you just pick a project and you try to make money with it. Yeah. Um, at FFA, you know, we do different things, like what well, Hannah said with the SAEs. We do an SAE. We usually fix a bunch of tractors in the shop, um, take animals to the fair, just make money that way. Hello, welcome to Mace County Career Center. This is the welding program. My name is Mr. Herford. Um, in the welding program, we strive for certifications. We operate a simulated workplace and our students work on a variety of different projects and learn a variety of different skills that hopefully they can one day use to get a job. That's the whole goal with it. And it's fun and the, the kids really enjoy it. We get into a lot of good stuff.
Hi, I'm Mitchell Freeman. I'm the uh, shop foreman of the Mason County Career Center. Uh, we treat this like a job to simulate the workplace and stuff like that. Uh, we do lots of projects, we work with, work with the community. Uh, well, a lot. It's a lot of fun. I'm Tanner Mitchell. I'm the shop foreman here at Mason County Career Center. And I think this program is uh, beneficial for us here in Mason County because of the simulated workplace and the safety meetings. It's real close to what you'll get in the real world. Real world. Come on in, guys, welcome. Uh, Steve Durbin, I'm the instructor here for Mason County Career Center, HVAC. It's a good class for the students, and show you a little bit of what we're doing. We got one, one tech here working um, on charging a unit, getting it ready to, uh, for service for the people. And over here, We've got we've got stuff set up also that we can uh, we can make ductwork metal everything. It's a good class. I uh, like anybody like to take my class. I'd love to have them in here. And we've got a young gentleman over here raising up a unit. He's getting ready to fire this unit up, put it in service. And this is just this is just a, a part of the class. I mean, this is just. A, but we do a lot of electrical work, we do a lot of plumbing work in here because uh, HVAC, of course you know, it's heating, ventilation, air conditioning and you learn quite a few trades in one class. And I encourage anybody that wants to take my class to sign up for it because you, even if it's just for your personal use, it's worth it. And if you want to go find a job somewhere, you're looking at forty to $60,000 a year Hey. Come on in the automotive shop. This is the automotive service technology uh, section of the career center. Uh, as you can tell, these guys are in here all working on something different. Uh, we teach four main courses, which is AST1, AST2, AST3, and AST4. What that is, is automotive service technician training classes, so these guys can become automotive service technicians. Your elective classes are MLR1 through MLR4, and that's just maintenance and light repair on basically any general vehicle that would come into a garage. These guys are my second year students. They are in MLR 4 right now and AST 2 because of the school year change. We, we kind of switched up our curriculum. We do anything from tire rotations, tire changes, brake jobs, oil changes, all the way up to engine rebuilds, replacements, and transmission replacements. Suspension, steering, brakes. We touch a little bit of everything in this room. Uh, mostly preventive maintenance, and maintenance on vehicles. This class is designed to get you an entry level position into the field of auto mechanics. Uh, starting pay is somewhere between twenty to twenty-five thousand dollars a year, and you can work your way up to a hundred, hundred fifty thousand dollars a year working on cars, auto, automotives, and diesels even more if you choose to go to that field. Good morning, welcome to ProStart at Mason County Career Center. Um, ProStart program is a two-year program where we uh, teach students to be prepared to go to college in the culinary industry or to work in the industry, in the food service industry. And they will learn how to do knife skills, they'll learn how to do the flow of food from the time you purchase food through a record or buyer to the time that it is served at a restaurant table. Um, they learn how to um, correctly do temperatures in their steaks and they learn how to cut up chickens. They learn how to do basic 
Um, you can start again. <laughs> they learn how to do all their basic um, food service industry stuff. So, if you would like to come in and see the students at uh, work, we are making soup today. Um, in the food service industry, you also learn to, um, you can go into jobs as like being a chef, you can be a nutritionist, a dietitian, um, you can be a sous chef, there's um, marketing, there's quality assurance, there's a, there's a career ladder like is unbelievable in the food service industry. And in our class, you learn, you get a certificate of achievement through the National Restaurant Association. You get your uh, food certification so that you can serve food in Mason County and you get a surf safe food certification. We also do OSHA 10. We get a Welcomes West Virginia certification. We work on a portfolio in our classroom so that you'll be able to go out to the job industry and you'll have a portfolio of your work with a resume and a letter of um, introduction in your portfolio. We, do, we put pictures of things that we make in our classroom. And the best thing about culinary is we get to eat what we make. Welcome to Careers in Education here at the Mason County Career Center. I'm Brandi Sweeney. Students in this program learn about all the different professions in education. And in our classroom, we simulate or mimic what it's like to be a teacher in a classroom setting with students. So if you are ready to make a difference in the lives of a child or even just to have a fun learning experience, then you need to go get your application from your counselor for careers in education. Hi, I'm Miss Bale. I'm the embedded math teacher here at the Career Center. Um, embedded math means that uh, most of your math instruction will happen out in your CTE classes, so not necessarily all in here you know, for the whole period. Um, if you are in electrical, um, HVAC, machining, machine tooling, uh, automotive, welding or project lead the way then you will as a completer earn a math credit which means as a senior you don't have to take a separate math class so hope to see you soon <laughs> hi i'm mrs allender i teach embedded english and if you take the um, courses of careers in education uh, pro start or nursing you'll be able to get an english 12 credit so I hope you sign up and I hope to see you soon. Thank you. Hi, Mr. Lyons. I'm the guy you come to for help with anything that you're stuck on, whether it's embedded English, embedded math, you need to work on your portfolio, uh, maybe you need to pass a safety test. I'm the resource teacher. I'm here to help you pass whatever you're stuck on. Hi, I'm Carla King, the school counselor. I hope you've enjoyed your tour at the Career Center. We hope to see you next year. Bye.